just going for a nice walk so I would forgot on my phone and George had it in his pocket all the time and he's only just giving me now we finished yeah we only went for a short walk I've been up since half three with the dog um, she's had citizen diarrhea all night so we just wanted to give her some fresh air so I've been lying on the couch all night with the door open absolutely freezing so she can be in and out so I got her a handbone yesterday she's never had one before she had half of it and then all night she's just been restless so I think that's what's done it so note to self never buy her a handbone my cup's gonna go flying I just made myself a coffee when George decided we'll go out so I just brought it with me so yeah Happy July, everyone. Ten years this month. This yeah, ten years this month since my dad passed away. God, it's gone quick. So you coming down now? Where were you? No. Have I left that lead on the on the back for you to get tormented by? I don't think I can reach it either. <coughs> No, I can't. You'll have to just deal with it, dog. Um, I hadn't even brushed my hair today. I just tied it in a boil. Well. <laughs> but never mind. So, yeah. That was a nice walk you missed out on. Because George had you in, my po in his pocket. So, I'll see you all next time. Bye. Bye. Time to get all this chopped off. Have you seen how I hate how frizzy my hair is? Yeah. Time to get it topped off. Oh, look at them roots. <laughs> How do you like it? I just need to get these roots and that done now. Hey, baby. It's way too hot. She's going to keep hitting my hand now. She'll get stroked. I don't believe it. I've just been talking to you for the past five minutes and I didn't even press record. Oh, that's the dog, by the way. She's... She's... I can't, I can't show you. She's got my hand. She wants a stroke. Uh, we're just dying on the couch with this heat from in front of a fan. Way too hot. Way too hot. Oh, <clears throat> I forgot to tell you all. Um, you know when I cut my kidneys come back all fine and everything well apparently it's not the kidney specialist still wants to see me so I've got an appointment on the 18th of July at half 8 in the morning for um, ultrasound on all my organs and then on the same day at half 2 I've got to go back to the hospital to see the kidney specialist with a sample. So, a week to go, then flies to do my head in. But I just need the doors open. Had three keep landing on me this morning, it was doing my head in. I can't believe my buddy didn't press record. That means I wouldn't have got the dog either, because I was showing you the dog. That's doing me heading too. Who's got a ring doorbell? Because you've got the washing out, haven't I? So every time the washing moves, the ring doorbell goes off. And we're also <clears throat> chatting to two of you subscribers. Well, I would say subscribers, but you've become friends. Uh, Lisa and Megan. Hi. What? What are you banging your tail about for? You wanted a stroke. Let's see if I can hold the camera with this hand. There you go. There you go. Yeah. It's like too hot. Too hot. 
Eighty look, I don't know what I've done now. I believe touched the screen, haven't I? Oh, I'll tell you something, tonight I'm gonna run a nice cold bath and just soak in it. My hair needs washing anyway. So I've got it up in a headband. Well, plus keeps it away from my face. Not that it's a very good face, especially lying like this. Bloody hell. Well, how are you all coping with the heat wave? I mean, it's even worse in the car because our air cons broke. Whoo! Yesterday, I drank so much cans of pop. I never drank so much pop in my life. It was just so hot. So, I had no water. And because we were out, I only had my phone with me, so I had no money to buy water from a shop. But George always keeps a case of cans in the pot, in the car. So I had about, I'd say about eight cans of pot yesterday in the car. And it was just ridiculous. So today I'm down in the water. I've already finished one bottle, uh, uh, bo uh, one bottle of soda water. I do like that now and again. But I just thought I'd come on, say hello, see how you're all doing. George gets undressed down here. By the way, that's his clothes. He got undressed and he's gone upstairs in front of the fans because I've got this one. <laughs> he hates wearing clothes. He walks around in boxes 24-7 unless he leaves the house. So It's just easier for him to get dressed there and undressed there. But he come down this morning, he goes, where's my clothes? I was like, I put them in the washer. Go and get some clean. So, yeah, I'm going to go and I'll see you all later. Bye. Good evening, world. How are you all? Been for a little drive in the car. Cooled down a bit with the windows open. This heat wave is horrible. But I am dreading this weekend. All the way through from Sunday to Thursday, it's going to be high 30s. I nearly died at 29 degrees this last weekend. I mean, come on, cool down a bit. George is moaning he wants an aircon. That's all I hear every night. Me and the dog need an aircon. So, I'm like, yeah, I'll just buy one, shall I? So, my hair's all over the place. I hope you can hear me with the window open. be a bit quieter. I don't know. You're not supposed to use them in a petrol station, but never mind. I don't think you are anyway, unless it's just calling. I don't know. But had a nice coffee iced coffee on the on the drive with sugar free caramel. It was pretty lovely. I've actually got a free one for Costa on my phone and it ends today. If you bought one last Saturday, you got a free iced coffee until from Saturday to Thursday. And we've just never been anywhere. We've been going to Martins and Spencers. So, never mind. I haven't been near a Costa. So, waited two hours the other day in the car for. Um, car broke down and we, the RAC so noisy it's just only me a little put put um, yeah went to the galleries to collect our prescriptions the other day come back out went to start the car it wouldn't start so we phoned the RAC because that's who we were with five and a half hours I said so we phoned the AA 
they wanted £150 because we're not with them. And then last resort was like phone Graham who does our car servicing and everything and he, come, he said it would be about an hour but it was two and he come and told us. I was like oh my god it was so hot sat in this car but luckily we managed to we managed to get the windows down at least but it was saying the memory in the key fob was lost so we couldn't it, it just kept saying the key was locked out so that was joyful so yeah just Thursday today I've got to eat non fatty non no milk when you're ready i can't remember what else it says on sunday i've got a no i have no milk or anything because i go for my scan on monday so yeah I'll let you all know how that goes. I don't think we'll be doing anything this weekend with it being in the high 30s. And if this doesn't get all loaded, it's because I'm dead. Heat stroke. So I'll see you all later. Bye. Morning well, world, how are you all? Just got back from the hospital, so chilling on the couch. With it being really hot today. Mm. Um, I've still got protein in my earring, mm. but I had a scan this morning my kidneys look great and everything. So he thinks it's just my diabetes and I had high blood pressure this morning. So he thinks it's just the combine of them two that's that's doing it. So I'm on new tablets for both. Um, it took blood. So if everything comes back as the blood okay, I won't hear from him for three to four months to see how my tablets are going. The only thing is, the tablets for diabetes, I think it is, it says it can prone you to water infections, so I'm not looking forward to that. Because I feel like I'm dying when I'm on them, especially when it hits my kidneys. So, I'll see you all later. Bye! Don't mind our little forest here. George hasn't cut the grass. Well, he's done it once this year. But, the sun... Because of the heat wave is killing my apple tree. But I have got one, one over there, three, four, five, six, seven, seven apples growing. So hopefully the sun doesn't knacker them all together. Look at it, a forest in our garden. Morning well, don't mind me. I've just, my back's gone. So I'm just lying on the couch. Um, you can hear the dog panting behind us. We just come back from a walk in the vets. So she had a health check. Now she's lost weight. But anyway, it's first and I forgot to put my video up or vlog since I come back from the hospital, I don't think. So it's been two weeks since I've been on my tablets. Um, I keep going dizzy and like my head feels fuzzy and like I'm going to faint. And it's always like the first half of the day. But because I'm taking two new tablets, I don't know which one it is and I can't exactly just stop one. Don't mind the noise, George is trying to fix the car mirror. Um, stop nudging me, but yeah, so George says oh, it'll probably take it took about a month for him to get used to his tablets. Um, so he said he felt the same way, so I'll give it a month. If not, I'm gonna have to phone the doctors because one of them is not agreeing with me. The thing is, what I say as well, I think it's the blood pressure tablets because I've always had good blood pressure and when they took my blood pressure at the hospital, I just walked halfway around the hospital and I'm big, I'm out of breath. So to me, it's got to be high. And to me, it should do more than one 
you should do more than one set you should try it a couple of times you know make sure it's not just a one-off but put me on them on the first try you did so I don't know we'll see and I'll see you all next month bye